In life, there are laws. In growth, there are laws. If you want to learn and grow, you must observe, pay attention, and take decisive action to ensure these laws work in your favor and not against you. The greatest achievers on earth pay attention to the laws of growth and success so they not only achieve more, but also live a richer, more fuller life. Here are the four important laws of growth. Pay attention, listen closely, take notes, and take action. Number one, speak less. Number two, listen more. Number three, react less. Number four, observe more. Now listen closely as we go over each law, why it is important, and how to go about applying it in your life. Number one, speak less. Let your results speak for you. You don't always need to tell everyone what you're up to or what you're planning to achieve. Let your results do the talking. People will notice and respect you more if they see your results before they hear your plans. The majority of great achievers talk less than they work. They talk less than they achieve. You'll rarely find a great man or woman talking more than they achieve. In fact, if you think about how ridiculous that statement is, you'll understand it is impossible. How can one be great if their talking outweighs their doing, if their results are less than their words? That is not greatness. It is ignorance and arrogance. Talk less. Do more. Let your results speak for you. Number two. Listen more. You cannot learn if you do not listen. You cannot grow if you do not learn. So, learn to listen more. Learn to listen better, more intently. Listen with purpose and intention to get something out of it. If you are serious about making your life as great as it can be, you should be committed to be an eternal learner, a student of life. You should be as committed to curiosity as a child. The kind of curiosity and presence that will enable you to notice things others do not. And that will give you the advantage. Take in advice from the best teachers and learn from the failures of the worst teachers. You really can learn from everyone from the greatest failures and the greatest achievements. Pay attention, listen more to be more. Number three, react less. The less you react, the better you can respond. Don't jump to conclusions or let your emotions overpower you. You have to discipline your emotions and your reactions to every person and every circumstance in your life. Discipline gives you power, and this is especially true when it comes to controlling your emotions. There's an important quote that says, one of the best lessons you can learn in life is to master how to remain calm. When it all seems too hard, remain calm. When it all seems too good, remain calm. Don't overreact. Don't over-celebrate, master calm. Practice being calm in all situations, looking at every situation objectively and calmly so you can respond effectively. As the saying goes, learn to discipline your emotions because if you don't, your enemies will use them against you. Number four, observe more. The closer you observe, the better your understanding. And the better your understanding, the better your decisions will be. Pay close attention to those you admire. The people who are living a life similar to that you want to live. Pay close attention to the teachings you want to master. The principles you want to master. The skills and habits you want to develop. 
Observe what works and what doesn't work in your own life. Pay attention and observe yourself, how you feel physically and mentally after all events and circumstances. Observe, evaluate, and make changes accordingly. And finally, the principle of growth everyone must add to the recipe, take action. As Bruce Lee said, knowing is not enough, we must apply. Willing is not enough, we must do. If you want anything in life, it's not coming to you while you sit on your hands. Get up, get out there, and get it. Make a decision that you want it, and do whatever it takes to get it.